All right, so I just came into work here and I do have something extremely special to do today. So basically, we've had a lot of complaints against a mailman um, here in Springfield. Now, I'm not too sure what he's done, but apparently he's been super, super suspicious and he's been doing some fishy things um, around the housing suburbs while delivering, um, you know, mail to uh, the houses. So today, I'm going to, you know, watch him from far away and observe, uh, you know, how he does his, you know, how, how he goes around the housing suburbs and how he gives out the mail. Maybe I'll find something else, I don't know, but that's why I'm going to be going, um, you know, observing this suspicious mailman and seeing exactly, uh, you know, what exactly he's doing. Because, of course, you know, we have no idea what he's been doing. So um, we just had a lot of complaints. Um, so, yeah, we're just trying to figure out exactly what's going on. Um, yeah, so he should in about like two minutes about, um, you know, come down here uh, to the Springfield housing suburbs and deliver mail to the houses. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to be intercepting not intercepting him but i'm gonna be i'm start i'm gonna start observing him from over here i believe because he should come from this road uh all the way from river city of course because that's where the main uh postal office is so yeah let me hide my car in a bush over here and uh yeah we'll see if he passes by um but yes housing suburbs are looking super super peaceful today um okay wait the, the, okay the van is right over there um the mail van sorry um so yeah so yeah apparently i don't exactly know what i'm expecting like i really don't know what to expect here like I don't really know a lot of information. I'm just gonna follow him around and see exactly what's going on here. Uh, okay, all right, okay, the mail van is coming up over there. Okay, let me take my binoculars out because I don't think I'm gonna be able to see uh, much detail from uh, with my bare eyes. All right, so it looks like he's uh, parking right over here uh, to deliver mail to this house. Um, okay. All right, so he's getting out of his vehicle. I can't even see what he's doing. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah, he just put mail in the mailbox. Now he's going to the house for some reason. Don't know what he's doing going to the house. Does he have like a package to deliver or something? Um, this is really interesting. Okay, okay, he's ringing the doorbell. Okay, now he's talking to. Is that a kid? I think that's a kid. Jeez. Okay, what what is going on? Okay. Uh, right. Okay, this is really weird. Uh, okay, okay. Now they're talking to each. Wait. Okay. Now he. Okay. Why is the kid following him? What is going on? This is super weird. Okay, wait, what is, okay, okay, he's bringing him to the, v to the van, um, okay, what, is, okay, what's going on over here? Yo, he just got in the van! Oh my god, he just got into the van! Okay, I think I'm dealing with the kidnapper over here. Oh my goodness, he just put the, oh, and now he's going to another house. Okay, wait, I need to move my, okay, I need to move my vehicle here, because I can't see anything from here. Okay, I need to take pictures of this, bro, this is absolutely ridiculous. Okay, let me move it over here, uh, right over here. I can't really see much anyways, but, uh, right, I don't even know where they are. Okay, I think the door's, like, hidden over there, so I can't really see what's going on. Bro, this is not, okay, I'm not gonna intervene yet. I'm gonna call for backup pretty soon, but this is ridiculous. Oh, God, okay, wait, there's, is that a teenager this time? Jesus, okay, yeah, he is, like, kidnapping the whole neighborhood. God, is he, like, wh yeah, oh, oh, my, oh, yeah, he, okay, he just went in the mail van as well. Oh my god, okay, now he's moving up to another house. Okay, okay, looks like he's turning into another house. I guess he's gonna kidnap another person. Oh my goodness, okay, uh, right, so I'm, I mean, okay, I can't really intervene on my own, because he could hurt the kids, That and that's definitely not what I want over here, um, so yeah, I'm gonna call my other sheriff guys pretty soon, um, alright, uh, hey, to all units here, I, you know the mail van that we were talking about for a while, well, I just discovered that he was kidnapping kids from the neighborhood, so, um, I'm gonna need all of you guys on standby here, um, as soon as he's done with whatever he's doing, um, I'm gonna call, um, I'm gonna call you guys, and you guys should all respond, okay, and we're gonna pursue him, um, let's just not do anything right now, because, um, I, I feel like it's just a bit too risky responding right now, so everybody just be on standby and be ready, okay, um, anyways, okay, so we got all the sheriff department ready in case, or not in case, I mean, we're definitely gonna intervene, but, um, yeah, in case, uh, well, not in case, why do I keep saying in case, uh, well, when, um, the kidnap, or the kidnapper's done, how many kids can even fit in that thing, like, Jeez, like, uh, yeah, okay, he's, I guess he's kidnapping another person this time. How many, I think this is like the fifth person or something, fourth or fifth person. Don't know what's going on over here, um, but yeah, okay, okay, I, he's behind a bush right now, so I can't see him. Um, but yeah, I believe he's talking to another kid, yeah, okay, there we go, another kid. How are all the kids falling for this? Like, I don't even think this guy's that young, he's, he looks like he's like 20 years old or something. I think there's only a couple houses left on this road, so maybe that means he's almost done. If he starts going on the other road and starts kidnapping people on the other road, I just don't know what to say, okay? Oh my god, yeah, okay, just put him in this vehicle again, okay, I think that was the fifth 
person over there. That is so crazy, bro. I, I, I mean, I didn't know what to expect, and I'm, gu I'm guessing now I, I have an affair with a kidnapper, okay? Which is, uh, not definitely not the best situation here. Um, but uh, yeah, this like, yeah, one, okay, one, two. How many people did he kidnap? I, I think he kidnapped like three people. Like, okay, uh, maybe, I think the, he, I think he kidnapped five people in total over here. So. Oh my god, yeah, okay, he, like, is he, is he telling them there's, like, candy in his van or something? I don't know what he's telling them, like, how do they want to go in his van so badly? Alright, so I believe this is the last house, because I think after this, he does have to go, oh god, okay, yeah, I am a bit closer than I was before here, so I do have to be a bit careful, actually. Yeah, okay, here we go. Um, okay, he's going to the house here. I can't believe he can't see me, I'm literally, okay, look, I'm right here, and he's right there, and he can't see me. And he's doing this in front of the whole sheriff department. Look how many sheriff cars are over there. And he's just kidnapping people. Oh, okay, is there another kid? Oh, there's another one. Oh, God. This is so ridiculous. Why does he need to kidnap all these people? Is it for, like, a ransom or something? This is, like, so ridiculous. Okay, I th okay now he's going away. Now he's going away. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, here we go. Okay, just gotta keep following him. He might want to kidnap more people here, but I'm not sure yet. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna follow him from far, be uh, far behind. Uh, from far behind i think um yeah okay looks like he's trying to get to springfield um okay right so he's got like about five or six kids in the back of that mail van which is definitely not super great it looks like he's gonna turn on the highway okay i'm about to call the sheriffs here they're all right there i think they're all waiting all right three two one go all right uh to all units um let's uh get the pursuit going uh with the kidnappers van over here is on the highway do make sure to not be too rough with the actual vehicle um since uh yeah there are uh five or six kids in the back of that uh truck there um but yeah i'm gonna be taking primary so uh don't worry about it um but yeah so he's heading to the end of the uh highway here uh turning off the highway going on to freedom avenue i think yeah going on to freedom avenue um but yeah okay let's have some sheriffs come up over here uh all right so um he's on freedom avenue right now all right okay he's turning uh here inside the uh river city house suburbs not too sure uh not river city house suburbs, just river city i'm not too sure wh how he's gonna want to you know lose us with this massive van he's literally still using his turn signals to turn i mean he's tur still using his turn signals i don't think this guy realizes he's in a pursuit okay he does he just turned a red light but anyways he's tur still using his turn signals for some very weird reason over here i'm not too sure why um and he is pretty much respecting the speed limit not too sure if he wants to get away with this by respecting the speed limits i'm not too sure he knows how the law works and everything um but yeah okay let's uh yeah he's he's not losing us any day he's not losing us anytime soon here turning into the three guys uh drive through for some reason um and yeah he's going he's even stopping for the stop signs like this pff, does this guy actually think he's gonna get away from us like this like i don't know maybe he thinks that if he respects the speed uh, limits and everything and the, the the rules he's gonna be able to get a lesser sentence but that's definitely not how it's gonna work and like he even stops with the red light and everything what is he doing um but anyways okay we've got everybody still on the pursuit over here um but yeah let's try and get him on a uh you know bigger road over here so we can actually try and spike him um but yeah this is a pretty slow pursuit here in river city so definitely better than a high speed per per pursuit um so we are um, i am pretty grateful about that i don't know why we have a police car that just flipped over guys that's uh pretty embarrassing but yeah so looks like he's heading towards the tunnel if we can try and get some spikes uh if we can try and predict where uh this guy is going to be going here and just try and get spikes somewhere um on a road uh that would be great um but yeah like he is not definitely not escaping anytime soon here um his car goes super slowly and I mean, he's not he it doesn't even look it doesn't even look like he wants to escape um all right so yeah it looks like okay we're turning here uh into valley drive um but yeah i don't know where those spikes are guys but we needed we do need to get spikes somewhere okay he's still using the turn signals for some very weird reason i'm um, turning into the dirt road here so this is definitely going to be diff more difficult to spike him um on a dirt road uh but yeah okay looks like he's going um into river city housing suburbs oh my god i mean poor kids in the back of those things 
because they're probably getting like flung around in the back because I do know that there's no seats in the back there's only two seats in the front so they're probably like getting banged around with the mail over in the back I mean definitely not a fun experience for them um but yeah okay I don't know where he's going here he's trying to yeah okay he's trying to break check break check me all the time I'm not used to pursuing a criminal that stops for stop signs and everything so it's definitely a bit weird um but yeah okay get spikes on the highway somebody go and get spikes on the highway there you go all right um okay oh <laughs> i think that male van just wanted to smash into him. oh god oh okay turning back on riverside drive over here um yeah okay if we can get spikes somewhere guys spikes 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 i don't know where the spikes are guys but let's go um okay uh yeah i'm gonna try and go uh further up on riverside drive and uh try and uh oh, okay okay we already got spikes over here okay we're good we're good we're good all right perfect 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 i'm just gonna wait here until uh to intercept over here um all right perfect whoa yeah i thought you were gonna get spikes i would have done it if you didn't do it oh my god that was the worst bro i think he was searching in his trunk for his spikes i don't think he was ready Okay, turning back on the Freeman Avenue. God, he almost flipped over right there. Um, all right, we're driving on the wrong side of the road here. If everybody can keep the good side of the road for now, uh, just to keep it a little bit less dangerous over here. God, okay, okay, okay. He's swerving. He's starting to swerve. Now he's starting to look like a criminal that actually wants to escape us instead of somebody that's just driving like a normal person here. Um, but anyways, okay, under the bridge, turning onto the highway, guys. This is the chance to get some spikes out, okay? So if somebody wants to go on the highway to get some spikes, this is the time. This is the time. Um, okay, okay. Uh, Van is still not on the good side of the road right now. Um, but yeah, okay, I think we have an officer going to get spikes. Oh god, okay, 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 okay. Nope, nope, no, that did not work at all. Oh god, okay. This van is starting to speed up a lot, going way too fast. Uh okay, okay, we got more spikes. That stop streaks. Jeez, okay. Oh my god, okay, oh oh okay, we got him, we got him, we got him, we got him. He's on two wheels now. He's on two wheels. Alright, here we go, here we go. Stay in your vehicle with your hands up, stay in your vehicle, stay in your vehicle, do not move, do not try and escape. Oh my god, he just got flung around. Okay, everybody stay back everybody stay back he does have a bunch of kids oh my god okay everybody stay back everybody stay back we don't know if he's armed or not we don't know if he's armed all right stay in the vehicle stay in the vehicle do not move do not move okay the kids are there the kids are there all right all kids come to me come to me come to me guys quick 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 everybody run to me everybody run to me behind my vehicle guys behind my vehicle quick 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 god yeah okay they can he kidnapped so many people okay uh right okay yeah stay behind our vehicles okay stay behind us stay behind us all right okay kidnappers in here kidnappers in here get out of the vehicle with your hands up do not make any sudden movements all right all right oh okay 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 drop any weapon you might have drop any weapon you might have all right here we go here we go all right all right okay let me get my cuffs out here uh oh he's escaping he's escaping all right taser 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 there we go there we go stay on the ground stay on the ground stay on the ground all right okay there we go there we go okay uh right uh let's uh yeah if you can uh if you can get some cones around the scene over here uh so cars don't start smashing into us over here uh so yeah if officers get some cones blocking off the roads um and uh yeah make sure to take some photos of all the evidence and everything and if somebody can call ems and dot as well um and uh yeah call ems perfect um all right uh yeah so yeah okay are you guys all right you guys just yeah i'm hurt okay um my head hurts yeah okay my head bang jeez yeah I, you guys you guys were pretty brave there um yeah if you can just bring the kidnapper far away from the kids maybe to one of the vehicles on the other side because this is a yeah okay um yeah okay uh yeah officers if you guys can just take care of the kids um just bring them some soda or something that you guys might have uh uh, if somebody got um, some takeout from uh, three guys, then just give it to them, please. Um, but yeah, okay, perfect. We got the roads blocked. Uh, somebody go and take off the stop stri stop sticks um, over there on the highway, so we don't have any cars that get spiked. So they're getting candy and everything. Okay, are you guys all right? What did the mailman even tell you guys? Like, I don't know why you guys were in the vehicle. Didn't your parents tell you guys to never follow a stranger, especially not in their vehicle, especially when they had a white van, especially when they offered us free candy? That's exactly what you guys shouldn't be doing, guys. This is... Guys, who are your parents? I need to know who your parents are, guys. This is not normal. We all, we all said, yes, it's free candy. He didn't even give you guys free candy. Uh, uh, I was looking for package. Yeah, okay. Um, all right. Well, now you guys get actual free candy from us. But next time, you guys never, okay? This is your lesson learned, okay? You guys never tell or you guys never listen to a stranger who says, who, who tells you guys to go in your vehicle, okay? Even if they tell you guys, because like, Santa Claus is my dad. Oh, God. All right. Okay. 
Uh, I guess we're dealing with some uh, five to six year olds over here. May I have soda? Wow, what's what a polite way of asking. Of course you may have some soda. Here you go. All right, uh, all right. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's get the scene blocked off, everybody, and take some photos of the evidence. Somebody get a detective down here as well. Yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, please like and subscribe. And if you want Snake to go in prison for the rest of this life, then do make sure to like and also subscribe. If you do want to join videos like this, then do make sure to join the Discord linked in the description down below. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.